Hello and welcome to another review video from How to Webmaster. Today I am reviewing KeywordTool.io. Here I am inside of my dashboard and I have here in this example the keyword is WordPress and it found 543 unique keywords and it gives me the total search volume of everything relating to WordPress. So here is the trend for the last 12 months. It gives me a nice chart graphically showing me that the trend is kind of going downwards. And let's scroll down and here's all the keywords in this example and you can organize by volume, by trend, cost per click, competition. So let me reorganize this from uh, highest to lowest. The competition is for advertisers bidding on the keywords. It shows you how competitive it is for the advertisers or if you were buying ads on Google. So this doesn't really give me a detail or details on how competitive this keyword is if I was to try to rank for it organically. So I don't really like this competition data unless I was a pay-per-click advertisers then it would make more sense to me but if you're a blogger or a website wanting to rank for this keyword I don't know how useful it is to have the advertiser competition since it's not really that relevant to natural or organic rankings so anyways uh, that's the WordPress search results from Google and let's try YouTube so this will give you keyword ideas for YouTube search results results and the total search volume at YouTube for WordPress and the trend is kind of similar at YouTube as well and here it gives you the volume and all the similar details and let's check out Amazon let me check out a different keyword so right now I'm searching for a massage chair competition is pretty high a lot of advertisers it seems like a lot of the data are not available yet when I reorganize it by competition all these data some of it are updated so there's just a lot of competition for this keyword massage chair related and you also get keyword research for eBay Play Store Instagram Twitter let's see how Instagram looks not sure what this is about okay so it gives me the hashtags relating to my keyword and the number of posts for these hashtags and let's check out Twitter and they couldn't find anything with massage share at Twitter. Let me try a different keyword. Okay, WordPress, 912,000 search volume, which is even more than at Google. Okay, so it's pretty much just the hashtags, 900,000 search volume. I don't believe that's accurate, or maybe that's just the number of hashtags with the uh, WordPress in it, but the label is, I don't think that's accurate to say it is search volume. And now let's check out Analyze Competitors. Enter in your domain or website. I'm just going to type in Namecheap and see how that looks. And basically you enter in your website or your competitor website and then check out what you're up against right here. All the keywords that they're ranking for. Total search volume keywords that they're ranking for. Average competition, the trend. And here are the keywords. So big competition for whoever is up against Namecheap. All right, and the last thing is check search volume, which is pretty much a bulk keyword tool that you can enter up to 700 keywords that you can get from the Google Keyword Planner in your AdWords account or Bing or whatever. And you can type it in here, select the location. All right, I just enter in a few keywords here. Now let's enter in a location, network, Google. You can also select Google and search partners to get you a, a, a broader search network volume and then the currency of the advertisers competition now let's get search volume data all right so here are the search results give you the search volume for your keywords trend competition and the CPC so pretty much the same as the find keywords except you can enter in your own keywords if you want so in a nutshell, KeywordTool.io I think is pretty useful if you want to search for a bulk amount of keywords and look for the search volume and the trend. I like uh, those features. But to gauge the competition for organic competitiveness of a certain keyword, I don't think it's good to rely on the advertiser's competitive competition score. I don't think it's relevant. And also KeywordTool is 
kind of expensive to use. I think uh, Long Tail Pro is a little bit better if you want to find micro niche keywords with organic ranking uh, competitiveness score. Long Tail Pro is better and also cheaper. I have a review video of that down below if you want to check it out. But other than that, Keyword Tool does have more engine power when it comes to bulk search volume analysis. It gives you more keywords per day and also more search engines from uh, others like Amazon, Bing, YouTube. But anyways, that is my review. I hope this helps. And until next time, happy marketing.